Hello and welcome to this IP integration demonstration video. In this video, I will be showing you how to generate and modify a forecast within the Genesis Cloud solution. So to start, I will go to the admin section and under admin, I will go down to the workforce management section. There, I will click on my forecasts and the forecast screen will come up. I now click on add because I'd like to add a new forecast and I can put in a description for this particular forecast. I choose my creation method. For this particular one, I'm going to be importing my forecast. So I click browse, I find my forecast, and then I import it. I click add, and it's now adding my forecast. And we now see that my forecast is displayed on the screen. From here, I now just simply click the expand so I can see that more information, and I can click on the add button. And so I extend the screen a little bit more so I can see the more information. Under metric types, you'll see that I've got offered and I also have average handle time. Once I've set my metric type, I go to modifications, I make my selection. And now, as you can see, I can change the percentage. When I make a change to the percentage, you will see that the graph changes. To drill down into each day, I just click on that particular day and the graph will change to that particular day. If I hover over any part of the graph, it will show me my forecast information. And as again, I can change the percentage and we can see the graph changes. Once I'm happy, I click finish changes and I click save. So now I can move into the forecast grid itself. Here I can see all my times in increments and I can change all of the offers if I need to, which will again change my forecast. I click finish changes and again, click save. And that's it, this task has been complete. However, we do appreciate that this is only a small amount of what we can do with forecast. If you require a full demonstration of forecasting or WFM, please contact IP Integration. We'll be more than happy to give you an in-depth demonstration. Thank you very much for watching this video.